Hi, hi, it's Yvonne. We are at the Goodwill on Austin Bluffs. Sale tags are green, yellow. Let me think. They changed yesterday, so purple should be the other 50% off. You give really well, per okay, I don't know. <laughs> White, purple. All right, so getting serious. Hard goods first. I'm gonna do vases. I did grab something. <laughs> you guys know what time it is. <laughs> grab something off the end cap. That's really nice. It's only $2.59. It's a little sewing basket made in Japan by Dritz. That's cute. That's all I've grabbed so far. I didn't even look at rounder tops on the way here. Wait a minute, that might be, I thought that might be Raku. No. No, no. $4.99. I was looking at that for personal use. That's not bad. Prettiness, but then I want to pick up from here. I found some bamboo plates. These actually can cost just a, you know, a little bit of an investment for those that like to be really echo. I'm grabbing my cart. Hang on. <laughs> for those that like to be real echo friendly. They're kind of tempting because I know they can cost a little bit to get that many set up. Okay, but anyways, this is for sure, right? I feel like... <laughs> How much is this? $6.99. I'm going to get that. I watch uh, Laura Caldwell. And I think she bought something like that. And all of her people loved it. So. But I think she kept it for herself. I'm not sure. So I think I'll get that. Maybe give her a shout out. That if she had anybody still begging for it. I've got one. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. $2.99 for those baskets. Oh, I kind of want one of these. I wonder how long this would last outdoors. I'm getting ready to do all my planting. Um, that would probably only last one season, wouldn't it? You know what? These are actually, they're like, you know, not beginner, but not professional yet, but there's something so sweet about them. She got the sky right in the trees. It's just 16 by 20s. There's something so precious about these. They're real lightweight. $4.99. The other one is signed. Melanie or something. Those are kind of cool together. Okay, I need to think about those. Those are kind of cool. <laughs> Just looking around. Oh, I like that. It's not real, of course, but it's only a dollar. Oh, what is that? Hang on. <laughs> These are not acrylic grapes, but look at that. Velvet grapes. A dollar ninety-nine. Wait, what? Is that a thing? I wonder if I should get this for the booth. Like 14 inches long, very soft velvet. Okay, $1.99. I kind of want this. You know, the downstairs room that I'm doing, you know, 70s and some jungle plants. Um, there's some corners that don't get any sun. Ooh, that was real close to a glassy baby. Too thin, but that ombre, that was, that was really close. Yes or no, y'all. Okay, next end cap, I can tell I'm getting this. I bought one of these a couple weeks ago, but it never made it to the booth. I kept it. <laughs> This one's $1.99, so let's get that. Let's come back up. I want to look at this acrylic piece. Yeah, that. $1.99. That's in great shape, too. A little bit of abalone on the bottom. This is hasn't yellowed. Couldn't quite read that. It's a little faded. All right, so far, so good. Anything else on here? 
music's loud at this location and customers are having fun. So I hope you guys can hear me and I hope I don't have to do a voiceover. <laughs> $4.99. I don't know what that is. Looks like just a part of something. Okay, let's turn the corner to the Shotsky and Knickknack aisle. Ta da! Does this one look familiar yet? This is the one on Austin Bluffs. Some of you that watch all my videos by now probably can tell. Okay, I know we've been to this one before. Oh, I know that one. <laughs> Donna, Donna Harris hand painted that it looks like. I don't know what the blank was. $2.59. It's pretty though. That's an acrylic um, salt or pepper shaker. Oh, that looks vintagey. Maybe Fitz and Floyd or something. It says F that that might be, but why does it say made in China? Did they start having stuff made in China as they got as the years gone by? Oh, that's cute. It's a cute little fused glass piece, and someone made a little fork to go with it. This could be commercial made, but no, it's signed. Yay! Dollar twenty nine. You may get into the cart, sweetie. I don't think I want any more glass chunks. That bowl looks like you could set it different ways. Last Supper? Is this a cat? What? <laughs> it's got kind of a lava texture. It's made in China. $1.99, but look. <laughs> All right, let's see if this is vintage or not. Simply shabby chic. I wonder if that's because that might be from that original lady that trademarked that name. I better investigate that. So it's not going to be real vintage, but it still might have some value because of that branding. I've never found anything with at her actual brand on it, so let me double check that. Oh, look at this. $1.99. I've never found one with that. How do you... Some people call that horse hair? I'm not sure. Nice pattern. There is a name in Boston there. I can't quite read it. That's good enough for me, and it's $1.99, and there's no cracks. Yes, that's good enough for me. Well, there's a couple cool pieces in the furniture. This is modern, but it would be great for the people that like that look. This part is metal, wood, like a fake wallpaper look, and then this is the chalkboard. I don't know what that's for. I'm checking for hangings. It's lined in silver thin metal. Back it up. <laughs> so that is about five feet long. Three by five feet. Thirty dollars. I'm sure some of you love that. So I'm showing it to you. And this is kind of nice too. Now they want sixty dollars for this. This is about almost five feet wicker dresser or what I say armoire oh it was a TV stand okay nobody really does that anymore our big TVs don't fit in there but you know now I'll just use it for something else that's nice too huh all right I'm headed over there to look for Afghans I've only added a light bulb for my disco lamp that Steve put together they do have some um, okay, these are too much of a hot mess. Now this one, actually, I'm torn on it. 
like there's some loose threads I think it would be okay to snip off I don't think it would unravel it actually has not been let me zoom in it actually has not been washed and worn too much at all I'm not the co the colors look like they'd be good you know for a couple of themes that would be good for boho too lots of the browns it's only $7.99 it's a fairly good size chevron I'm used to paying about $5.99 and $6.99 for that size <laughs> okay now this one has been through the ringer a little bit but it's a shawl there's no price on it so if it's like a dollar 99 or something i'm just going to get that for that quirky person that's i like to sell that kind of stuff <laughs> see this one now this one see no that's just too too worn that one's not bad just simple though 3.99 it's kind of simple and small. What is that? That's a nice looking tablecloth. Okay, I don't see any more. Let me turn around a little bit more slowly. Yes, these are all sheets and stuff. Um, I think I'll pass on that brown chevron, but like I said, if this one's cheap enough, I, this is quirky. A quirky triangle shawl with fringe all those crazy colors yeah i want it i want to try to sell that hi you guys i don't know if you can see me in that mirror it's kind of warped but hi so i'm in clothing nothing much is on the rounder tops but that's okay um don't feel like doing clothing but i just wanted to look at pants you know in my size real quick i just kind of go and look at the length so the fabric but i did score so can I tell you about these real quick? I pulled them out because of that cool thing for a boho look. They just happen to be Levi's, but these are not your average Levi's. These are Levi's made and crafted. Let me turn them around for you. These are women's high-rise skinny. And they are only $8.99. Here's the different tag in black leather. See that? Made and crafted. A little bit different look to the back pockets. This one has a blue tag. These are super cool. I'm getting them for me. They're my size. Thank you. The last pair of Levi's Made and Crafted that I bought and sold were men's. I found them at Ross for about $14.99 and I sold them on Poshmark for $180. So for those of you that want to know, investigate Made and Crafted by Levi's. It's a specialty line. High rise skinny, 721s. Oh gosh, I hope these look good. They're my size. Okay, so you know what? I see that. That's beautiful, isn't it? Wow. What does that say? Rush Limbaugh. Oh man. Is that does that really say that? Darn, because it is silk. Cause that is 100 percent silk. Hand rolled edges. Okay, maybe that says something else. No, that says Rush Limbaugh, doesn't it? <laughs> I hope that music's not coming through. I love it. This is the one that plays old school jams and stuff. Rock. They're playing the Ohio players right now. Love roller coaster. I wonder if that's that Georgian copper. Can't tell. It's too small anyways. I sold a large, I sold a large candelabra, like, you know, like big by Georgian. Is that, I hope I'm remembering right. By Georgian? I think so. Um close enough and it had the lucite candlesticks in it with the copper I think I got like 60 bucks for that now I'm gonna do this right this is a pug right 
with its little baby. Eight ninety nine. That's a pug. Yes. Final answer. I came back to look at blazers in this cubby hole. I always check all these for any kind of decorations that might be cool. But look what I found at the very end of this. This is pretty exciting. <laughs> a book on the leak glass. I don't know how much it is. Oh, single pricing they've moved to. I'll go look in a minute. Oh my goodness. Let's see if there's any vases in here. Okay, this is a great book to have for my reference collection. So that's happening. Let's run over here real quick and find out what the new pricing system is children's picture books pay, okay dollar 99 yes <laughs> so one more stop today um, last video or video before there's some things you guys pointed out I should have bought <laughs> so lots of donations coming in yay so I'm gonna pop in here real quick and see if some of those items are still there and maybe what might be new see you inside this place is packed. It's a half price to sale day. I did a quick run through and I didn't see anything that I should have bought the other day, unfortunately. Um, I'm just kind of tucked over here at furniture. It is super noisy and packed. I'll show you what I did pick up real quick though. Sugar Skull or Day of the Dead um, salt and pepper shakers. This Roseville crock hand painted that's cute I think I see a few cracks so I'll have to investigate a cute mug it'll be half price 50 cents now I know this is personalized but it's wood I'm gonna sand that down I want to keep the cat isn't that awesome I'm gonna pay $3.99 for it hope you guys can hear me seriously it is so busy in here um, just these are for me and I don't normally do this. This is broken, but it is so awesome. I want to try to save it. I really do. I don't know if I can. Let me look it over real well in a more quiet corner and see what if I think I can salvage it somehow. It's so nice. That's such a shame, isn't it? Such a shame. Oh, it's musical too. Yes, it is musical. I don't know if this could be done, but we're gonna try to save that, you guys. So yeah, it's super packed, super packed. <laughs> Bringing in furniture. I'm gonna go look at Afghans and get away from hard goods for right now. Plus, after doing New Horizons, <laughs> Oh, this place is a madhouse. After doing New Horizons, I am now having even more sticker shock. Like, some of these other thrift stores are going to find out there's a new sheriff in town. That's cute too, isn't it? Super cute. Oh, and a matching desk. Look at that. 60 for the long dresser and 50 for the desk. Precious. All right, you guys, I got to get out of this area. Let's go look for Afghans. Did not find any Afghans today, but I did grab this from the lamp section. It will be half price. It's a happy light. And if I remember correctly, those sell for a pretty good amount. Also might just be good for all of us in my home. So I'll go plug it in when I get over that way. Um, a lot of the Beanie Babies are gone, I see. There's still some I wanted to back up, though. I don't know if, if you guys remember the 90s. <laughs> One of my stores had all of those posters along the top for a while. 
let me see what that says. Yeah, 1991. 999. That's an original vintage poster. I remember those. They're awesome. I should probably get that. 10 bucks. I only found one other thing. I might be crazy too. <laughs> I don't know. Wait a minute. Okay, I don't know if any of you watched Younger. That was a lot better of a show than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be making fun of, you know, older ladies versus the younger ladies. But it wasn't. It was awesome. Lindy turned it on to me, my friend Lindy Glenn. Anyways, if you watch that, it, it's awesome. You should. Remember Diane and all her huge statement necklaces? <laughs> That's what this reminds me of. So it's $6.99. They had it over in belts. That someone has made. I just, it's got really nice beads on it. Some of those are glass beads. I feel like I want to get this. I'm going to. <laughs> I'm trying to work my way over to the plug in to check out that happy lamp. So the Vera Lux happy light does not work, unfortunately. But I dug something out of the cart as I was passing through. So I think I might get this. I don't like paying $12.99, but that's pretty cool. It's a repop, of course. Hang on, Hannah just got here. <laughs> okay. Um, so I'm really gonna wrap it up. Now, I, they are putting more stuff out, so I might just take one little sneak by. But other than that, I think I'm gonna have to tap out for today, y'all. It is calming down, though. So I think Hannah and I are gonna Say goodbye. <laughs> pit stop. Those of you that watch me a lot know what I'm doing. It's Tuesday. This is where I get some of my packing supplies. It's always super clean. Just filled with plastic bags and hangers. The trash they keep separate. Okay, I'm going to get me a few more bundles. I'm down to my last one. <laughs> Bye, you guys.